Hello and welcome to the show. I'm here today on FIM Speedway GP. Can we take a look at the career mode? Last time I played this game, I was just trying to learn to drive one of these bikes. Uh, so I wanted to do this game a little bit more justice. Uh, now that I'm a little bit more experienced, I'm still not amazing with them, but uh, I can hopefully go a few races without uh, without falling off. This is a fantastic game. I'm really enjoying my time uh, playing this. And the career mode is really rather interesting. So I've done the first race of the career because it was at the same stadium as I went to last time. So I wanted to show off a different, a different track. So we shall go continue. I came seventh uh, last time which is not too bad, not too bad for me. I probably fell off in a semi-final, which was uh, my bad on that one. Um, but uh, yeah, we're going to have a go with the career mode. We're going to Finland. No idea what this track is going to uh, to be like. Uh, we will go to... First of all, we'll go to configure. We'll go to configure the, uh, the bike because the career mode, there is a whole kind of a parts thing to be worried about. As you can see in the top right there, I've got some uh, some monies. You you know you compete in the events, you earn more money, you can buy better parts for your for your bike. So we go into engine, for example. There are all of these different engines that you can buy. We've got 3,000 uh, coins, so we've got to be a little bit careful. What we may do is uh, perhaps go for... Uh, should we go for a slightly better engine? Or do we just... Uh, I think for now, uh, we will uh, stick with uh, this engine and we'll just repair the, uh, the the thing. You can see at the we've got a slider. It'll... Uh, you, you, can, you can repair it to a certain amount. So if you've only got so much money left over, you can uh, you can you can repair it to various amounts. But uh, yeah, there we go. We'll fix the engine up good and proper. We can get uh, a different clutch. We can get a better clutch. Shall we go for... We'll go for one of these. Uh, actually, it doesn't really matter at the moment. Uh, particularly, because I don't I think this uh, we'll go for a slightly better one because I don't think the engine actually has that much torque anyway that I've got in the thing so you'll have to buy better clutches I assume to be able to make the most of the more powerful engine uh, yeah it's only got torque 92 so uh, admittedly it's, you could probably do with it on that but uh, yeah so you need better clutches for better engines I don't know what happens if you try and run a clutch that the wrong the, 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 too low a clutch I guess you just can't use the power now tires is where things do come in quite interesting actually so for the very basic of tires you get five five sets for every single event but of course you can buy much better tires you can go down here you can spend up to 210 coins for the best for the best of the tires uh, but you'll be buying that per set of tires and tires will uh, they wear about 20 percent a race ish so after a couple of races they're pretty much spent so yeah you can go back to using these these default ones if you want what i'm going to do is if we go shall we be brave yeah, let's go for for buy them, and we'll buy we'll buy a few sets of these. So we've got three sets of them, a little bit expensive, but uh, we'll run the standard set for perhaps the first couple of heats, and then if we make it to the semi-finals, we can run these better tyres uh, and so on. Frames again, as you can imagine, plenty of these to uh, to choose from. Uh, I'm assuming that the parts protection thing means the parts wear a lot slower. So things like engine and clutch wear wear slower. Maybe tyres wear slower as well with the better frames. Uh, we'll go for. Should we go? Oh, should we spend lots of money on a, on a better frame? Or maybe not quite. Uh, oh, screw it. You know what? Let's go for a light frame with good parts protection. I think it'll be a, a worthwhile investment if it protects the parts quite a lot. It means we won't have to spend as much money repairing them. And you can get engine oil. This is another another really quite a cool uh, cool little thing. So again, you know, thirty five percent engine protection. Your engine will wear a lot less, but you will have to replace the oil. So the standard oil is free. So you get this you get this completely free, but it's only a little bit of protection. You can choose to spend some more money on things like this. And then if we go and buy a whole bunch of this for the next race, there we go. We spent quite a lot of our money upgrading our bike. I think it's a really cool way of doing things. I really like this system. With, with all of these options and things to change, and the fact that you've got to keep buying tyres and, and, and so on and so forth throughout the career mode, I think it's I think it's great fun. I think it's a really good way of doing a uh, career mode and a really good way of kind of having to do to do budgeting and so on. Right, to, uh, to Finland. I've had one go, one practice mode around this uh, around this circuit, just so, uh, I, I, yeah, just so I wasn't completely and utterly awful. Uh, it's an interesting, interesting place. This one. We shall skip to uh, to our to our heat. Uh, it's uh, yeah, quite a. It feels narrower. Is the uh, <laughs> the feeling that I got from this when I went driving it? Seeing as the the Warsaw Stadium is the only one I'd driven, uh, you know, for for the practicing and for the first video. Uh, this place here, it feels a, a narrower circuit. I also think it's a little bit of a longer circuit as well. Let's see how we fare though. 
in this first race. I think I may have actually uh, accidentally installed the good tyres for this first one. Never mind. We will see. We will see what we do on uh, on this one. I didn't really pay a huge amount of attention to the heat map either, or the, the, the track grip map, so I'm an idiot. Um, one thing that I have kind of been... Kind of have been doing... Oh, no, that's all gone. That's all gone horribly, horribly wrong. That was poor... Poor decision making from me there, and I do apologise for that one. Uh, <laughs> crap. Uh, what I was going to say before I promptly splattered myself across the floor, uh, I have tended to be uh, running a little bit safer, you know, while there will you will find more grip on the outside and so on, I have tended to be playing it a little bit safer, running kind of in the middle, to try and avoid falling off uh, as much. That one there, I tried to go, uh, what tyres? Oh, we are... Okay, right, we are using the good tyres at the moment. Well, they've only used a little bit of their grip because I fell off immediately. So, <laughs> sure. Uh, let's keep with uh, let's keep with that. That works for me. Uh, yeah, I have tended to be playing it just a little bit safer to try and not make those silly mistakes. Uh, so I won't quite be running right up against the wall until I am uh, really, really confident with the uh, with the bikes. That mistake there, I was trying to uh, when you're when you're leaning forward for cornering. Uh, you uh, will go, oh Christ, we're going to get bumped in towards the wall. Yeah, when you're leaning forward, you need to lean forward to go around the corners. You need to release it to go down a straight, and then you lean back, you'll go quicker in a straight line. I was trying to go from leaning forward to, to not leaning forward too quickly. Uh, last time out, because I was a little bit behind the pack, I panicked and made a mistake and promptly fell off. So it's all it's all this balancing act around how to uh, how to ride these bikes, how to try and get the most out of them. I really do quite enjoy it, and the actual racing itself is really quite good fun. It's really close racing. Oh, gonna get a little bit of a bump. Most part, AI pretty good. I have got served into the wall a couple of times by them, but uh, yeah, they they do a pretty good job of making the the racing exciting. Although this leader here has absolutely buggered off. Come back here! Oh crap, we're going to fall to uh, to third if we're not careful. God damn it. I think I might need to start looking at tuning the bike. I haven't really touched upon any of it yet, but uh, around here, I think we do. Uh, they do seem to have some really good straight line speed on me, so we may have to. This is not going too well. Oh, we're going to get third. We're going to get a point by, <laughs> by two tenths of a second. Yeah, not the... Uh, that's actually a pretty decent, decent time. But, uh, yeah, they were bloody quick. Okay. We've got a point on the board, at least, which is better than we were. <laughs> Someone's still got no points. I suspect if we skip to our next heat, though, we're going to be... Yeah, we're, we're, we're a fair way down. We've got some work to be doing, especially if we want to try and get into the uh, the semi-finals. I believe we have to get into the top eight to get into the semi-finals. Uh, so, yeah, if we can get that far, that'll be quite good. Right, okay. Uh, choices, choices, things that we can do. Right, tyre pressure determines how much the bike adheres to the track. More pressure increases the rate of entry. I don't... Let's leave that as it is. I'm kind of just about got the hang of the handling uh, for now. Gear ratio defines the acceleration at start and max speed. High values give the better start, but at the cost of max speed. So we can either go... We can go gear ratios, or we can... Engine RPM defines the possible maximum speed. So we can either go... What does torque do? Uh, increases acceleration. So you can up the torque, but you have a higher chance of your engine failing. You can up the RPM, you give you higher top speed, but you'll wear the engine quicker. You can have longer gear ratios, but uh, you'll get you'll be worse off the line, but faster top speed. What I might just do is give it a couple of... There we go. We'll have a little bit longer gear ratios, a little bit more maximum RPM. Uh, so, yeah, that should that should work. Worn-out bike parts can result in mechanics. You get a mechanical failures. That's quite cool. Uh, I don't want them, but it's quite cool that they're there. Now, do we go... Uh, what are the tyres like? I think the, I think the tyres, like these worn tyres, are probably still better than the standard ones. So we've, we have lost some of their peak grip, but uh, I think we'll keep, we'll keep with them. I don't really want to replace them unless I really, really have to. Also, this event is not exactly going to plan, and if I keep throwing money at tyres, I could well just waste all of it, because uh, I'm not sure I'm going to really be able to make it into the... Uh, into the semi-finals, but we shall see how it uh, how it goes. I've still not got uh, the trick really of getting uh, as fantastic starts as these guys do. I'm I'm better. Oh Christ, this is gonna go. Oh, opponent has fallen off his bike. It wasn't my fault. I thought I was gonna get told off for causing a collision. I didn't. It's all good. Thank you. I, I'm glad we got a restart. That one there was all going very very wrong, very very wrong, very very quickly. <laughs> in in all of that, oh, he just fell off on his own. Can we? I don't, know if it, I don't know if this is going to work. Oh, it will work. Uh, let's have a... Who was it? Who was it who fell off? Uh, I don't know. Who, who fell off? Wasn't him. Wasn't... Uh, it was him. Oh, he fell over completely and utterly on his own. 
Nothing to do with me, <laughs> which is good. Fantastic. Uh, right, that means... Uh, well, I'll, I'm guaranteed a point, I think, from this. Even if I fall off now, I'm guaranteed a point. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll have to... We'll keep with these tyres. I think we're going to have to just stick it out. Uh, yeah, because as I said, I don't think we're going to do particularly well. I, I love that, that kind of having to budget with uh, with the parts and so on. That's, that is a really, really cool thing. I don't really know. No, no games have really quite done it in, in such, a, such a manner as this one. Uh, whoa, where is he going? I don't know. He's going to cause me all manner of problems. Right, so last time we were topping out... I don't even know what speed we were topping out. I wasn't paying attention, so I don't know if we're doing better or worse. Apparently we're doing we're doing worse. We're not really going uh, <laughs> particularly well uh, around... Yeah, we're sort of stuck back here. Uh, perhaps we should buy a new engine next time out, I think. Yeah, we are really struggling. They are really going going for it down there. Hopefully we can earn enough money from all of this to get a better engine. Oh, Damn, there's nothing I can do here. I, mean, I could try running higher up the track, try and find some grip. I'm kind of just hoping that they bump into one another. That would be kind of useful. Uh, should we try running up here, see if we can find some grip? I don't think it's really going to be... It's not going to matter. We're so, <laughs> we're so far down on them. Did I turn things the wrong way? Ah, I think I know what I did. I think I may have... Did I put my gear ratio the wrong way, perhaps? Because we are really, really struggling for, for speed. I'm pretty sure I saw we were doing like 59 or something down the straights, so maybe I have uh, bulged that one up ever so slightly. Okay, that was a terrible run. That was an absolutely awful run. Did not make the most of uh, of uh, someone falling off in my heat. And I'm down the bottom. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> God damn it indeed. Uh, right, so did we gear ratio, acceleration, higher value means better start. Ah, right, okay, yeah, I put that the wrong way. That was my stupid. Uh, <laughs> there we go, right. Went the wrong way. We've definitely got to go for some new tyres. Now, here is the uh, the conundrum. We have we have some of them. I'm going to stick them on for now. It's eight percent more grip than them ones. Yeah, sure. Okay, we'll go. We're going with these. We're going with these tyres. I have to do well in this pretty much if I'm going to. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can't even make it to the uh, the semi-finals now. But we shall try. I shall try at least to get a half decent uh, a half decent time this 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 run. Right, better gear ratios this time out should give us a little bit more speed. We should be a little bit more competitive. Uh, yeah, the, the launch I'm still awful at. I can get it, like, I can't get the initial jump as well. I can get off the, the leaning forwards well so I don't actually lose as much time. Right, here we go, 62 miles an hour. That's more like it. I just moved the slider the wrong way, god damn it. Aha! Uh -huh. We're in the lead of the race, and I'm getting the hang of this uh, this track. Yeah, I like the the different challenges. There's just slight slight different challenges you got to worry about. I do find myself wanting to turn in far too soon for that corner. This this fight, well, the kind of final corner, second corner, whatever you want to call it. I do keep wanting to turn in too soon, and I'm not sure why it is. But uh, yeah, it's just something that I am uh, wanting to do. That was quite scary. Running up towards the, <laughs> running up towards the wall there. That's why I tend to just play it a little bit safer in the middle of the in middle of the road. While I don't have the uh, amazing amount of skill on this game, yes, there is slightly less grip through this part, but uh, it's better that I stay on the bike. Well, this setup change has worked lovely. Now we've got things working. It's around the final corner. We're going to get victory in a wow. That's a good time for me. Immediately, and my <laughs> the AI celebrates by bumping straight into a wall. 61 seconds for the four laps. Wasn't even really that challenge. Looks like there was a great battle behind me for that second place. That was, uh, <laughs> yeah, relatively straightforward for me at the the front there. Woohoo! We've moved up after four rounds. We're up into eighth. That victory did me a world of good in that. Oh, we might make it then into potentially potentially the semi-finals ah but we have oh god if we can get a victory here we really need another win we really need another win uh do i stick another set of okay how are we doing tires oh do i chuck tire no chucking tires on it is just wasting money uh, <laughs> um uh no we have to run with it as it is i think uh it's it probably not gonna make a big enough difference to be worth it not for me anyway uh, right, start race. Yeah, the track is this. There is uh, some some grip, some more grip on the outside, so we're gonna have to play it a little bit, uh, a little bit more on the risky side, possibly. If we we really, really need a win after those poor first two rounds. We really could do with a with a win here to kind of make it safely. I say I don't even know if a win here is gonna make it safely. It will probably still depend on what other people do uh, as well. 
Right, we are all going to try and squeeze our way through there. I think it's the two Brits at the front of uh, this particular race. We're going to go side by side. There's going to be no grip down there. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, no, 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 no. I had to have a little lift off the throttle. <laughs> so I'm getting a wheelie. Either way, we've got the lead. We're going to get a little bit of a nudge. But we are leading the way. We're getting the hang of this. Although we are going to find ourselves fighting for this lead. This is much more like it. Oh, thank you for that bump. That scared the crap out of me. As we go on to this third lap, this is a damn close race. I can't remember what the button is to look behind, and even if I could, I wouldn't press it because I've got to concentrate on the riding. Ah, someone else is fighting for the lead with me now. Don't know what happened. Oh, no, we're all here still. Ah. <laughs> Just millimetres away. I shouldn't be running this line at all. This is a terrible line to be running, but it is kind of working. Is it going to work well enough? He took a tight line on the way in. Uh, oh, Christ, we're going to do it with a little bit of a wheelie. <laughs> what a race. Jesus, the guy that I was racing the entire time came fourth. That was uh, that was a spectacular one. <laughs> we got the victory I needed. I think, um, yeah, I was running dodgy lines through that. I was just panicking that I didn't fall off and run too close to the wall because I really needed the victory uh, in, in all of that. Uh, well, I think I am safely through now. Yeah, I am going to uh, to get through. It doesn't really matter what they do down that part. It's a slight change at the at the top, but we've made it through to some semi-finals. That's good news. That is good news indeed. Right, start this race. I'm not entirely sure we've been stuck. Uh, yeah, depending on where you qualify for the semi-final, you get to choose what gate you start in. Well, I'm going to be I'm stuck on the uh, on the inside. Right, the track is all nicely gripped up. We're going to chuck some tyres at it, I think. Seeing as I wasn't expecting to make it through the semi-final, replace the uh, the tyres. There we go. Yeah, we'll get some we'll get some new decent tyres on the thing. Seeing as we are now in a semi-final, uh, hopefully we can get a decent decent position here. Engine eh, is a little bit worn, is a little bit down, but uh, yeah, that should be uh, that should be okay. Right now we can run on the inside of the track where I kind of want to run, where my normal sort of racing instincts take me to run. We can run along there. We won't be losing speed uh, so much. Uh, right, we're going to point ourselves a little bit towards the middle of the thing. I don't want to be too tight on the inside of the track down here. It's just asking for trouble. If you run across the inside kerb, you can get yourself disqualified as well. If you run too far across the inside kerb, you'll get yourself disqualified. So, yeah, I I'm kind of happy to... Ooh, okay, we've not got the turn in there at all. What on earth happened? I don't know what went on in all of that. I kind of turned in and it didn't want to slide. Oh, that's irritating. <laughs> That is irritating. I think someone also crashed someone else off. That's um, bugger. I think we're going to come eighth now. God damn it! Skip to the finals. That's really annoying. That after all of that, after all of that, I get to the final, mess up on the immediately on the first corner. Ah, god damn it. Uh, well, sure, we'll go have a. We'll have, a, we'll have a go at the next one, because I'm annoyed by that. Right, so we've got a little bit more money. Do we go for a better engine? Be careful spending too much money on an engine. Right, let's go for the next one up because we've got to go and buy a whole bunch of tyres. Buy some more. Yeah, we'll stock up on them and oh, engine oil as well while we're here. Uh, we've still got a decent amount of that. That should do the trick. Right, let us start this. Uh, start this round. I'll show season standing. Where am I actually sat in the season standings? It doesn't come up with like a big thing telling you we're in seventh. No, I mean, eh, sounds about right. Start an event. Okay, another new track to challenge. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing around here. What sort of track is this one here going to be? Um, right, we should probably... Wait, what? Uh, oh, right, so this is the default settings for... I guess for this engine, possibly? Um, okay, let's just kind of sit that little bit more back there and maybe just reduce that slightly. Um, okay, yeah, that, that, that looks like a... Right, okay. So we'll put it back to default. I don't know why it was all so very different. Okay, well, we'll, we'll stick that at default. We will go with this. I didn't replay the clutch, but it was at like 98%, or so, well, 94 so I don't know. It should be enough. This looks like a very short track. Uh, <laughs> the, I, uh, by the looks of the run towards that first quarter, it's all quite foggy around here. But, uh, hmm. Okay, who knows what we're going to have to deal with uh, around this particular circuit. Uh, oh, opponent has caused a collision already. Well, we're not. I'm not doing a very good job of getting past the first quarter here. This does look shorter, certainly, than the than the Finland one. Uh, yet someone uh, 
admittedly no, no massive harm was done that time out, but either way, it means I'm at least guaranteed a point. That's the important thing in all of this. I'm guaranteed a point in, uh, in this race. So you guys can keep bumping into one another as much as you want. I'm, I'm absolutely okay with, uh, with all of that. Because, uh, yeah, the, the more of you that fall off, the more points I can get without having to actually do anything. Right, let's start again. Well, he's already in the wall. Uh, uh, <laughs> thank you for that one. Yeah, his uh, trip to the wall there was uh, less than ideal for, for him and for me, as it turns out. Uh, what are we going to be wanting to do? See, I'm already now thinking, what can I do to the bike? What can I do setup-wise around here? What do we want to uh, make it that little bit that little bit quicker? I'm kind of tempted. Uh, I don't think we really want to put the gear ratios up any, because it's a fairly... This is much, uh, much more similar to the first track, the Warsaw Circuit or oh, Oval. Oh, no, 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 no. That's all gone wrong. I knew I was in a little bit of trouble when I started getting that wheelie on, and there just wasn't the, wasn't the grip to do what I was trying to do with it. Well, we're making that. That was a terrible heat for, <laughs> for me. Well, we got a point. Skip to the next one. Right. Oh, no. Do we not get a point if we fall off? Ah. Okay. That's my silly then. Uh, didn't realize that one. Uh, okay, then. Well, lots of us have got no points uh, from there. Kind of a little bit of a stalemate going on. Right. Do we want to do anything with all of this stuff? I think it's actually kind of okay. Uh, with the with the setup of the thing, now nah, you know what we'll go with. We'll go with all of that as it is. I don't think we need to worry again. No point. No point changing tires. We already did a couple of laps in that last one. These are still the ones from Finland. I think <laughs> we've got to go. We're making the most of them because we're just falling off of all of the bloody races. Okay, don't do anything as stupid as I did last last heat out, uh, and then we might be uh, okay with this. Oh Christ! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> immediately, immediately we get a big wheelie. Ah, there's just no... Uh, <laughs> that was... This This round has also gone very, very badly wrong. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> I did say I was trying to... I, I was better at this game, honestly. God. This is disappointing. I'm I'm getting annoyed now. Uh, what, what's happening is as I go to launch off... So to get, to get a decent start, I can't launch as quickly as them. So I'm going very quickly off the leaning forward. That time it was just a little too quickly off the leaning forward. And then I was all out of place with the wheelies. And uh, didn't really quite have time to adjust to where the other bikes were going to be. So, uh, yeah, well, th this round is not going to a plan whatsoever. Okay, let's leave it a little bit longer. There we go. Didn't quite get... Didn't get a massive wheelie. And, well, I'm a little further behind, so I don't have to worry about getting knocked off by uh, these guys. Right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> we're going to hopefully make a lap, at least. Not quite a spectacular uh, 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 race yet, as we had at Finland. Well, I mean, I'm going through the rounds quite quickly, because uh, I'm just falling off after a couple of couple of laps. Let's see if we can get... Uh, there we go. We're up into a third place, at least. Uh, can we get any better? I, I'm not sure what to do with uh, what to do with this bike setup wise. Like the other track was easy to go. Right, longer gear ratios would be good with the longer straights. But this one here doesn't really seem to. The, the, the straights I don't think are, are worth going for that uh, for a longer gear ratio. But uh, I don't really think I want to change too much on it. Uh, <laughs> I can't catch them. Uh, last time I got a really good line through here by running right on the inside, but it's not going to be enough. Ah, we're going to have to take a third place. Eh, it's, uh, could have gone worse. At least, I've, at least I have actually got a finish this time out. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Bugger. Um, I think, what did I get in my, first, my very first race with these? I got, like, four points, so we can't do worse than that. We've got two more rounds. We've got to get, um, yeah, we've got to get three points over two rounds. So if we could get a win in here, that would be, that would be good and slightly less embarrassing. All right, some new tyres, some shiny, shiny new tyres on. Do we want to put some more of this in? Uh, oh, it will replace after. Okay, it changes itself there, so that's all right. Uh, okay, let us begin and try and not completely fluff this particular particular one up. Right, I think we're in one of the, the slower heats. I don't know if it cycles, if there's, there's an order to it, or whether it's just everybody races everybody throughout the heats. I'm not, I haven't quite figured that one that one out. We are starting on the outside. Where, where I start is kind of irrelevant, as I said, because I can't get off the line as quickly as them lot can. Uh, right, uh, I didn't pay any attention. I forgot to look at the uh, the track map, so it's kind of guesswork again. I, yeah, I'm guessing there'll probably be grip outside. I don't know if it was just 
sort of well, I can't remember what they call what they call it like resurfaced or flattened or whatever it is that they they, they do with the uh, with the track so we're going to oh, get ourselves a little bit tangled up with the wild card uh, <laughs> look at us all synchronized with our speedway bikes oh and then as I say that I properly go and make a nuisance of myself that's what I'm here for uh, come on get up the inside get up the inside oh we're still tangling with the 71 there uh, <laughs> I am really making a real nuisance of myself uh, in this particular one. I can't quite get past. I've actually got good speed this time out. Let's go to the inside. Not quite enough steering that time out. Oh, we're up the inside into this final corner. And I have been finding some good speed on this part of the track. We're going to do it on the final lap. We get all of them. Fantastic. <laughs> That's more like it. That is what we want to be doing. Fantastic. That's, I think it's by far the... No, yes, it's quickest time I've done. Not by a long way, but it is the quickest, a quickest personal best, if we like. That's what we needed. Right. Not quite as much of an embarrassment. Still quite embarrassing. Not quite as much, though. Can I make it into the semi-finals, though? That is the question. I actually do stand a very small chance. Because there's been such a low-scoring round for a lot of us, there is a possibility. I have to win, pretty much. But it is a possibility, and that's not what I was thinking at the start of this. I really like this game. This is so much fun. Uh, the track has been resurfaced. Uh, do I throw tyres at it? Yes. Replace tyres. I'm throwing tyres at it, trying to make it into the semi-finals again. Uh, probably not a good <laughs> not a good budgeting technique, but screw it. I'm going for it. Uh, right. We really, really need a win here. Really, really need a win. I have no idea of the names of people, if anyone, if any of them are quick guys or not. Uh, yeah, we, we have to pretty much go for the win here if we're going to uh, we're going to advance. Right, actually got a very good start that time around. Uh, we're up into second briefly. Yeah, okay. Well, I'll I'll stick it around here for now. I don't know if I can get away with a second place if I'm going to have a hope in hell of uh, getting into the uh, into the semi-finals. It does look like the leader here has got some serious speed, probably too much for me. Oh, we're starting to fall over ever so slightly. Yeah, so if you go a little too soon from leaning forward to uh, to going back, you start doing a wheelie, and that's that's when you really really lose control of the uh, of the bike. So we don't want to be doing. To be doing that, but of course, the quicker you can get to leaning backwards, the, uh, the faster you'll get out of the corner, so you can make up some time. No! Ah! Crap. Oh, no. It's all gone wrong. I, sh ah. <laughs> I should have waited until the final lap to do that one. I saw an opening and I buggered it up. God damn it. That's all uh, it is. Ah. Oh, we're going to end up down in 13th with uh, all of that. Disappointing. Disappointing. Uh, I, I'm annoyed with that one. <laughs> Just pushed my luck a little bit too much. But, uh, yeah, this game is awesome. This game is really very, very good fun. I highly, highly recommend you uh, you have a go at this. Currently 20 quid on Steam. Career mode is is fantastic. The racing is really close, really intense. It's a new kind of skill to uh, to learn. I'm getting better, as you can quite clearly see. Not exactly mastered it. I'm getting better though with these bikes, and it's a lot of fun to uh, to go racing with them because there's lots of heats and you know and finals and so on. You get to have lots and lots of action uh, very very quickly all with it all. Uh, yeah, quite infuriating when you get things that little bit wrong, but uh, a great great challenge. Anyway, that is it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, uh, goodbye.